Try and keep the heels together. So we're going to revise this a little more now. I want you to, in fact, let's start again. Make sure we got this all the same. Demo formation, down. So listening to the words of command, please troops, I've asked for demo formation down. So these guys standing up have got it. Front rank, you're going to be sitting on your bottoms. Middle rank on a knee, rear rank standing up. We're going to discuss another exercise. Listening to words of command, guys. Demo formation, down. Right, we don't feel like doing it very quickly. Not a problem, guys. We're going to warm you up again. One lap of the track. Stand by. Go! your right hand shoulder there, you've got rug one. It's a large tent made, I imagine it saved money somewhere. It's actually holding together pretty well, but it is respected. The second you start abusing kit equipment in here, it will break. Happy with rug one? Yes, yes sir. Behind you then, or behind the majority of you is rub two. Rub two is exclusive for the RFTE uh, standard test. We're gonna go in there and do that in just a moment's time. For the sake of, uh, of simplicity, we're gonna get ourselves into height order. So when you dress into the rub, we're gonna use the fire exit, or there's a small sort of shutter door, looks like a fire exit. We're gonna move through that. Uh, what I then like to have is the tallest down that end of the gym, and then the shortest down this end of the gym. Everyone happy with that, guys? Yes, sir! Get in there, quietly get it done. Once you're in position, you can take on water, have a little sip of water if you'd like, uh, while you're waiting around. I will then address you when we're all in the right order and shuffle you around. Uh, we'll then move on to the test. This is just to stop an adjustment on one of the pieces of equipment. It sounds horrible when you pull the bar in and out. It sounds like grinding metal. So we're just gonna eliminate that by getting you roughly in size order so we do as few adjustments as possible. Does everyone understand? Yes, sir! Watch your dodge, stand still. Stand by. Go! Noise down, we're not comparing nails. Shuffle down this way, we're gonna use the whole breadth of the gym. I'll be surprised if you'll fit in here. Shuffle down please, shuffle down more. Watch out for the kit and equipment please. Okay, Peninsula Troop, uh, we're gonna go through the test now, the indoor part of the assessments. Uh, this will consist of a mid-thigh pull, done over there where the uh, other ball PTI is, and then a med ball throw, which will, which will go on behind you. Now the mid-thigh pull takes a bit of time to do, guys, so you must be patient. And along with that, you have to remember, a uh, gentleman like me with a single figure IQ are gonna be working a piece of equipment over there, so I need complete silence when I do that. If you're not quiet, I'll get really angry and we'll do press-ups instead, which is gonna affect your test score later on. So to the best of your ability, employ discipline and stay quiet. So we got, do you say 46 of me? 37, cheers. 18, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So break with a jump. Right, turn. Good stuff. Um, reach down, take control of the bar. So what we want is a slight bend at the knees, pins and shoulder blades together, keeping the arm straight. So that feels like a good stance. Bring your feet further forward as, as you're down and you're cutting the line with your feet. Good action, Dennis. Happy with that position? Is that how you want to lift you? Roger, dodge. Um, I'm going to count you down three, two, one, then you're going to lift consistently for five seconds. Prepare to lift. Nice and flat on a solid surface. Feet together, I might grasp the medicine, the medicine ball through, I might grasp it with fingers pointing upwards towards the sky. Everyone happy with that? Yes. Yes. Elbows tucked in, all right, and then you place the ball nice tightly into your chest from there. From there, you're going to perform an explosive movement, all right, so from there, as fast as you can, all right, as powerful as you can, you're going to throw this ball as high as you can as well, all right, and so like that in an explosive motion. From there, power. Fingers pointing direct, shoulders down, and then on the way to come on throw. So you get three, two, one, throw. Same again, make sure you get a slight bend of the knees, make sure your shoulder blades are close together and ready. Prepare to lift, so three, two, one. Lift, one, two, three, two, one, lift.
If one person in this grouping decides to give me an incorrect time or dwindle the number I've given them a little bit, you will all go again and again until we get this integrity test right. Do you understand me? Yes, sir. So it's really important to every individual one of you that you work together now because everyone's going to suffer if we don't. If we have dramas with integrity today, I won't allow you that nicety in the future and I'll do everything much more mechanically and lessons will become much more monotonous. So work well for me today and we should get off to a good impression. Uh, some varied results there. The run time in my mind is quite a big one, okay? I will judge you on how fast you run that route, okay? And that's a big thing for a first impression. So work very hard for me. Two sections, then three sections, then four sections, all in neat lines. The section that is most messy, young lady, I'm talking to you. The section that is most messy, okay, stand by. I want these to be a, a thing of beauty, okay? An unmade, a man-made object almost. Stand by, go! So guys over here, look for that guy with his hand up so you haven't established yourself yet. Keep your hand up. <laughs> guys, make it slick. This needs to be a quick drill that we do all the time. Good. Right, happy we've got our section lines here. That is a platoon or a troop job I've given you. So we need to be doing the same thing as a troop. So in the future, these guys are in the right place and then on and then on and then on. Okay, so we've got that uniformity in the troop. Happy with that, guys? Yes, yes sir. sir. Right then, uh, I said I'd explain the route twice. I'm gonna do that. Um, so, you're going to be starting off from M sign, okay, so we're going to be in alignment from this sign to the other side of the road, uh, and this will be your start point. Uh, I'm going to give you standby go, and you'll be going down in that direction. So everyone look over the left-hand shoulder now. The road meanders to the left and then over to the right, and that's when it straightens out past the parade square as we spoke about earlier on. So just paint a picture in your mind as I'm talking. Uh, that road will go straight all the way down, and then you'll see one of your permanent staff in a high-vis jacket, and they'll be pointing you so it will be left as he faces, okay? But you'll be turning right. So after a little while then, you're gonna be turning left and going up in that same direction, uh, past the range console and then towards Brunswick Camp. Everyone happy so far? Yes, sir. Brunswick Camp, you've got a slight climb, so the hill goes up a little bit and then you'll have a black gate at the end. Chap wearing similar clothes to me will be there. Uh, you'll, you'll touch the black gate, turn around and then come back in the same way you came. The markers will stay in the same place. That's the route. Now, I'll be stood by the bollard over here, uh, and when I stand there, gay, I'm gonna give you your timings verbally. So I'll give you whatever time that you get. So look over your right-hand shoulder now. Uh, you'll be stood over by where the corner of this smoking area is here. Uh, first person will be there, and I'm gonna peel you in. So the first individual stands there. Next one to come in will go around that side, and again, and again, and again, okay? So you'll stay in the same order you came, shoulder to shoulder. Any questions? No, sir. If, the, if anybody fancies going for a piss or just talking while you're there or shuffling themselves around, I will go off like the New Year's Eve fire, firework display. So just keep it together, okay guys? A bit of discipline, you'll be there for five minutes tops and then I'll relieve you, send you away to your water bottles, get your timings in, etc., etc. Any questions with the SOPs at the end of this test? No, sir. I think I've explained all my business there. Uh, I'm going to give you now 30 seconds to reunite with your water bottle, get your final sip of water, stand still. We're then going to form up behind the bollard over there, uh, ready to, um, to start the test, guys. Happy? Yes, sir. Stand by, go. Top tip, it happens every intake. Okay, somebody thinks they're Superman when they come over the line, and they'll come up to me. Imagine now Staff Campbell is myself, and they'll start walking about here. you lose a couple of seconds walking towards me. You want to run past me, get your timing, and then keep moving at pace to the area we spoke about afterwards, guys. Happy with that? Yes, sir. So where uh, Sergeant Ball is there, okay, that will be the first individual. Your toes will be on the curb. I've repeated myself a couple of times, I really want this to go smoothly, guys. Listen in, yeah, I know you'll be hanging out, yeah, and blowing. Just try and listen into what we're saying when you come back.
going to do good. Stop jogging, you lot! Hurry up! Good, keep going. Come on, ladies. Push, dig deep. 100%. Well done. Come on, keep going. Push it. Keep going. Push it. Good, touching the fence. Touching the fence. Touch the fence. Good, downhill slightly on the way back. Good effort, keep it up, touch the fence. Let's try and pick someone off on the way back. Good effort, touch the fence then on the way back, home straight. Good, just keep touching the fence. Overtake someone on the way back. Don't start walking now. Just keep the effort going, keep it up. Just make sure you touch the fence. Feel around, listen, remember, get around him. Hands up it. Well done, Walker. Good one. Well done, gentlemen. Good effort. Hands on your head, it opens your chest out. Get more air in. Stop it. All the way! Single file! The order you came! Come on, let's go! 100%! 10. 9 on 9. 10 men! We have vehicle! Even though it's from a little further away, we managed to get three minutes and 30. So that's the main body of troops coming around that track, coming back into it, and that's why we kept on going around again. Slowest individual there, two minutes and 40 seconds. It didn't take a whole minute to do this small stretch of road, did it? What changed in that time, troops? Your sense of urgency. You realise that that bald-headed freak is not going to stop until you run a little bit faster. So you applied yourself a little bit more. Those that came in first, those that applied themselves, got their reward. Second wave got another reward. You guys were just as fast as those waves, but you were not applying yourself earlier on. To excel in my PT, you have to give me 100%. 110% if you can muster it. I want you to go faster than you knew you could. Do you all understand me? Yes, yes sir! Hey, are there any final questions on the gym and the orientation we've done today? No, no sir! sir. If you retained your times, well done from the run. You do want to keep a memory on those because next time we do this run, you should be doing it a bit quicker, okay? And you want to see some progression. Uh, that's all I've got from you. Welcome to the gym at Purbright. Stuff.
Uh, so my name's Corporal Ilsley. Um, I've uh, just been running my intro uh, to gym staff and uh, the RFTE uh, for Peninsula Troop. Uh, this intake started on the 24th of June this month, so they are fresh in. The orientation's already always quite a hard-hitting exercise. Um, so it's been, a, it's been a bit stop and start. Um, we gave them their initial orientation around the gym and that went well. Um, we did the test and once the test was over, I went through uh, some of the things that I expect for correctional fitness. Um, they, they dealt with it well. We did a few laps of the track, did a few press ups. Um, I'm content they've all got the message now. We're gonna go through strength and conditioning one tomorrow um, and we're gonna go over fine details of the press up and all the, all the bits involved, um, the squat and the lunge off the top of my head. Uh, so that should be good. And hopefully we get a nice little confirmational circuit there. So uh, hopefully see you again for that. Thank you very much. Nice one.